What's up everyone? So the match I'm about to show you, it's a great example of what mental toughness is. This was the 2014 China Open Finals between Lin Dan and Srikanth Kidambi. Lin Dan had won this tournament five times already. So not only did he have his home support, but he also had the most experience playing here. And this was the first time ever that a player from India had reached the finals at this tournament. Another thing is that they had previously played each other two times prior to this meeting and Lin Dan won both of those times. So basically Lin Dan is expected to win this game easily. Shrikanth should be having intense pressure right now. He's playing the best player at the China Open and has lost two times to him already. But the way he started playing was the complete opposite. He doesn't seem nervous at all and he isn't making easy unforced errors. He just seems to be playing very comfortably. He's completely controlling the net. But Lin Dan isn't letting him get far ahead. He's challenging Shrikanth. Shrikanth is playing very confident. Look at how sharp his smashes are. He isn't intimidated at all by Lin Dan. He's also able to execute deceptive shots. This would have been harder for him to do if he was nervous, yet he does it so perfectly. He is in rushing as well. He first moves Lindan around and then he sets himself up to attack effectively. Lindan is trying not to be left behind so he starts to up the pace and pressure Shrikanth more. But Shrikanth isn't panicking. He keeps himself under control and forces Lindan to rush a bit. Shrikanth continues to control the net perfectly. Whenever someone is tense or nervous, you can see them do easy unforced terrors at the net. But Shrikanth is so confident that this isn't the case for him. Any other player could have been threatened by this situation, which is that you're playing Lin Dan at China Open. But the way Shrikanth is handling himself is amazing. He isn't focusing on any of that. He isn't letting his mind distract him. He's just there focusing on giving his best and being confident while doing it so. Shrikanth is proving to us what happens when you don't play your opponent's reputation. Just because he's playing Lin Dan doesn't mean he doesn't have a chance. Anything can happen, especially when you're completely submerged into the game. Lin Dan didn't seem to be that motivated in the beginning. He didn't have a sense of urgency. It's as if he was underconfident about himself, but he didn't give up. He isn't letting Shrikanth have a big advantage since he is getting back into the game. Now even though you could easily say that Lin Dan has more experience than Shrikanth, right now Shrikanth's mindset is far superior than Lin Dan's. Having this mental edge is giving Shrikanth the advantage overall in this first game. He never seemed nervous since the beginning of the game. He was always playing with a lot of focus and determination. Now if he would have focused on the fact that he's playing Lin Dan in China, and he had previously lost twice to him already, then his mindset would have been completely different. He would have been playing nervously, making lots of unforced errors. This wasn't the case at all. Even the commentators were amazed on Shrikanth's mental toughness. They for sure thought that Lin Dan was going to win the first game. They were basically saying how Shrikanth isn't playing Lin Dan's reputation. He's just playing a player and that's it. Now this is really important, especially if you're playing players that could be considered much stronger than you. Now you don't have to put these players on a pedestal. Yes, you can have respect for them, but don't worship them. They are human just like you and Shrikanth was aware of this since the beginning of the first game. That's why he performed the way he did and even right now he's playing with that same attitude. He isn't intimidated at all by the person in front of him. He's just focusing on his performance. The commentators were also saying that many players like Lin Dan solely win on reputation. Because they have achieved great results, a lot of their opponents become so nervous when they play against them and lose the game before it even starts. This is why I keep saying that a real opponent isn't the person in front of you, but yourself. You are the one who lets your mind distract you away from your performance. You are the one who focuses on the other player's achievements and worry about the outcome. But if you play like Shrikanth is playing right now, then it doesn't matter what Lin Dan has achieved. Shrikanth isn't thinking about how great Lin Dan is. He wasn't thinking about his previous games or how this current game could have turned out. 
You can just see by his body language and the way he's playing that the only thing he's focusing right now is on the present moment. He's playing in the zone. And even though Lin Dan is such a great player, if he isn't focusing the way Shrikanth is focusing, then there's not much he can do. This game was such a great example of mental toughness and what it allows you to do. Even if Lin Dan cut up and managed to win the game, it doesn't really matter. The results don't matter as much as how Shrikanth displayed this amazing performance. Just by playing your best game and being present in the moment, that's what truly matters. This is what allows us to see how great the sport of badminton is. And this is exactly what Shrikanth Kedumbi did in this game. Alright everyone, thank you so much for watching. I'll see you in the next video.